Tonight, a group of Bay Area students tackling human trafficking on a national level. The high schoolers created a mock bill for class, but as ABC Action News reporter Andrea Lyon discovered today, it's gained so much attention that a Florida congressman is now trying to make it a new law. People are being trafficked. They're forced into things they would never do. When one Tampa Bay Tech student enrolled in a government class, she never imagined the difference she was about to make. Some of those things include committing theft, prostitution, drug abuse, and all of those charges follow them once they get out of that lifestyle. Angel Lee wants to grant amnesty for human trafficking victims who committed crimes while in captivity. She crafted a potential law, but couldn't just leave it as a class project. Eventually, I just decided to email it to our actual senators and congressmen. Congressman Ross Spano took notice. You all can energize other people in your spheres of influence, and you can make a difference. Monday, four students and advocates for trafficking victims met with Representative Spano to talk about the bill. I can't fathom a reason why this bill wouldn't be widely accepted. The congressman will be presenting his own bill trying to pass a law allowing victims to overturn their convictions of crimes committed while being trafficked. A law Spano already passed at the state level. He says he may include their idea as an amendment. These charges could prevent them from getting jobs. It could also put them in jail, which would cause them more trauma. But none of this is their fault. They never wanted to do this. In Lakeland, Andrea Lyon, ABC Action News.